Hello everyone. Good evening. I hope you had a great day and welcome to Practically's NEET classes. So the NEET exam is over. It got over yesterday and today we have the question paper with us. Okay. So we'll try to solve the biology part of the question paper. There are around a hundred questions and there was a, a choice given actually like uh, out of the 100 questions, you have to attempt around 90 questions, okay? So, we'll try to solve all the 100 questions and uh, the questions were like quite actually, it depended from easy to moderate questions were there. Not a lot of hard questions were there. A lot of questions directly came from the NCRT book, like they quoted line by line and they gave the questions. So, I felt like it was quite from easy to moderate, not very hard. So we'll try to solve these questions today. The other thing is uh, what we, what I felt is like some questions were actually repeated, which I'll try to talk about it today. And the solution is what I found like the best solutions. What I found for the questions, I have. I'll be trying to. I'll be trying to talk about that only. Okay. So let's start. Now, first, I'd like to talk about who we are. We are from Practically and we have courses running from 6th to 12th grade and we have a lot of videos and simulations which you can check it out on our app. You can also like, share and subscribe to our videos on YouTube. You can also follow us on Facebook and Instagram. Okay, let's start. There are 100 questions and we, own, we don't have a lot of time, so we'll try to run. Okay, so let's start. Now, this is the first question. Which of the following statement is not correct? Not correct. Okay. So, we have to find the wrong statement. Pyramid of numbers is in a grassland ecosystem is upright. Okay. This seems to be correct. Pyramid of biomass in C is generally inverted. This is correct. Pyramid of biomass in C is generally upright. Okay. This is not correct. Pyramid of energy is always upright. Okay. C. Pyramid in bio pyramid of biomass of c in c is that looks like this okay big fishes okay which are the tertiary consumers there are small fishes which are secondary consumers then there are zooplanktons okay which are primary consumers and then are phytoplanktons which are the producers. So it is an inverted pyramid, inverted pyramid, okay. So the answer is pyramid of biomass in C is generally upright, no it is inverted. Okay, which of the following plants is monoecious? See, androecium, gynoecium, we know the female part and the main part. Monoecious plants are monoecious. These are actually imperfect plants. Okay, imperfect plants. Why? Because they have either have The flowers either have the male part, okay, or okay, the androecium or the female part. So they are not complete actually. So they are monoecious, and the answer is chara. Yeah. The first stable product of CO2 fixation in sorghum. Okay. Sorghum is basically a C4 plant. When we are talking about photorespiration. Okay, so when it's a C4 plant, what happens in photorespiration is, okay, it takes flower part in two places okay there is the mesophyll cells and the bundle sheet cells 
So what happens here? The first, we are talking about just the first stable product. Okay. So what happens here? The phosphoenol pyruvate. Actually, this is just the first step. I'll write. It's converted with the help of carbon dioxide and phosphoenol pyruvate carboxylase to oxaloacetate this is the first stable product okay this takes part in the mesophyll cell okay. after this this again uh, gets converted into malate then the reaction starts going into the bundle sheath and everything okay but the first stable product is oxaloacetate or oxaloacetic acid sorry oxaloacetic acid. okay the answer is oxaloacetic acid next diadelphus stamens are found in okay Let's see what diadelphus stamens are. Dia, de, see, we all know that the androsium is actually anther and filament. Okay. So there's the anther and the filament. Okay. So this is the androsium, the male part. So in diadelphus stamens, what happens? Okay. Some of them are fused together. Okay. So they look somewhat like this. They fuse together. They look somewhat like this. Not in even numbers. They are like in odd numbers. One can be three, one can be four, like that. They are fused together sometimes. So that kind of plant is diadelphus stamen. This kind of stamen is known as diadelphus stamen. And this is found in okay next dna strands on a gel stained with on gel on a gel stained with ethidium bromide when viewed under uv radiation appear as bright orange bands okay when you see it in a uv chamber or a uv box kind of a thing it comes like bright or bright orange bands which is given by the chemical ethidium bromide okay etbr okay so now children if you have any questions or any doubts or anything okay you can just come and ask me the questions in the section in the uh, chat box and i will try to help you out okay i'll keep checking the chat and if you have any questions i can help you out okay let's go back to the question part again C. Plants follow different pathways in response to environment or phases of life to form different kinds of structures. This ability is called plasticity. Okay, this is directly from NCRT book. This ability, okay, to form form different kinds of structures is known as plasticity. Not elasticity, not flexibility, neither maturity. This plasticity okay next there are this year also like the previous years this year also you can find a lot of match the following kind of questions i feel like these are easier to answer and does not take a lot of time okay so let's see protoplast fusion per plant okay this is about the tissue uh, tissues in the plants okay let's see Protoplast fusion happens in tomato, potato plus tomato that happens in tomato. Okay, plant tissue culture, okay, that is totipotency where tissue culture we cut apart and from there only another part grows. Okay, that is a characteristic of plant and that is used in the tissue culture that is totipotency. Okay, meristem culture is used in virus for virus free plants. And you, when you don't even know, okay, suppose I don't know that micropropagation uses soma clones, okay, I can just eliminate it out because I know all of these things. So, 
micropropagation is somaclones. Let's see. A2, B1. A2, B1 is the third option. This is the right answer. Okay. Let's see. Next. In the equation, GPP minus R is equal to NPP. R represents, let's see the equation first. GPP minus R is equal to NPP. Let's see. But NPP is actually net primary. Okay. Production. This is actually used in terms of why this NPP thing is used. This is the overall efficiency of plants and ecosystem efficiency of plants in ecosystem okay so npp is net primary production whereas gpp is gross primary production okay so it becomes gross primary production minus respiration okay respiratory respiration losses respiratory losses or respiration losses respiration losses is the net primary production okay so the r represents respiration losses okay next this is such an easy question okay the production of gametes by the parents formation of zygotes the f1 and f2 plants can be understood from the diagram on its square whenever we do f1 into f2 okay this was given by sir reginald punnett okay and it was given like for crossing the characteristics of uh, father's alleles, okay, father's alleles or mother's alleles, okay, father's alleles and mother's alleles. Okay, every person will know what this will be. Suppose the father is has the alleles brown eyes or black eyes and the mother has pure black eyes or pure blue okay something like this and we'll do a square father has black eyes mother has brown eyes so Half will have black eyes, half will have blue eyes, something like this. So, the square thing, okay, the square thing where we calculate the F1, F2 generation, this is known as Punnett square. Okay, next. Which of the following is an incorrect statement? Okay, let's see. Nuclear, we are asking, they are asking for an incorrect statement. Nuclear pores act as passages for proteins and RNA molecules in both directions between nucleus and cytoplasm. It is formed in the cytoplasm and it form goes to the nucleus like that. It, the exchange. Okay, so that is right. Mature sieve tubes, element, tube elements possess a conspicuous nucleus and usual cytoplasmic organelles. Okay, this is so wrong. Because the mature sieve tube elements do not usually have nucleus and as for cytoplasmic organelles, they have very few ribosomes. Okay, so... That is the wrong thing. Microbodies are present in both animal and plant cells, eukaryotes, so they will have. The perinuclear space forms a barrier between the materials between 
present inside the nucleus and that of the cytoplasm. So, the answer is second part. Okay, next. Another one, let's see. Okay. Lenty cells are used in exchange of gases. Okay. Cork cambium, that is phylogen, vascular bundles. Okay. So, you can call it cork cambium. The secondary cortex is phyllodum. After phyllogen and everything, it comes phyllodum. And cork has superin deposition. Okay. Let's see. A3, B1. A3, B1. This one. Okay. Just pardon the quality of the questions because we just got the questions and we just somehow we tried to manage it and answer it. Okay. Next. The amount of nutrients such as carbon, nitrogen, phosphorus and calcium present in any soil at any given time is referred as standing crop, climax, climax community, standing state. The answer is standing state. Okay. The term used for transfer of pollen grains from anthers of one plant to stigma of different plant which during pollination brings genetically different types of pollen grains to stigma. So, what happens here is like one type of, suppose there are two different kinds of flowers. So, the pollen grains go from one anther okay, to the different kind of plant and it is kind of a hybridization thing. Okay. So, that and there are, it is a foreign kind of a thing. The pollens are foreign to the, uh, this thing, the pollen, sorry, the style. Okay. So, that is xenogamy because cleistogamy is self-fertilization. It mostly happens in closed flowers, okay, permanently or permanently closed flowers. Okay, xenogamy is this hybrid thing, whatever we are talking about. Gatonogamy is again fertilization. of a flower by pollen from another like same fertilization by same kind of in the same flower or genetically same flower same flower or even if it goes to a different flower that will be genetically same here the genetically it is genetically different ketonogamy is genetically same chasmogamy uh, is like for exposed anthers and stigma okay so the answer is xenogamy which of the following stages of meiosis involved in the division of centromere the division of centromere happens in anaphase 2 okay after the second thing, it happens in anaphase 2. It looks something like this. Then do fibers. Okay. This is the chromatids. So, there is the division of centromere. Since it is anaphase 2, there will be two cells. Okay. Yeah. So, this is phase two. Okay, next. 
which of the following is a correct sequence of steps of PCR polymer exchange reaction? Very easy. This is like a basic question. Okay, PCR is denaturation. then annealing, denaturation where the strands go apart, annealing with the primer and then extension of the primer. Okay, so denaturation, annealing and extension. Such easy question. Okay, let's see. When gene targeting involving gene amplification is attempted in an individual's tissue to treat a disease, this is for treatment of disease. Safety testing testing is not treatment. Okay, biopiracy no, no, again not treatment. Biopiracy we have discussed before. Okay, it is where like somebody steals, like U.S. stole basmati rice and they patented it. That is known as bio biopiracy. Gene therapy is a kind of treatment okay and molecular diagnosis is again diagnosis not a treat so the answer is gene therapy next okay now we are going into the match the following thing okay this is okay it looks like uh, organelles okay whatever is there in organelles of cells okay christy Christy is the infoldings of mitochondria. Oh, looks like this. These infoldings of mitochondria known as Christy. Thylakoids. Thylakoids, basically, they are the flattened membranous sacs in stroma of pla plastic. Okay, they are in plastids. Okay. Centromere. Centromere is a part of chromosome, primary construction. Chromosome. Cisterni is disc shaped sacs in Golgi apparatus, where the Golgi apparatus looks like this. Okay, in the cell that is cisterni. Okay, so A3. So A3 one only has this option. Next. The factor that leads found to founder effect in a population. Okay, now I'll tell you what founder effect is. Founder effect is nothing. It is a very simple theory about founder effect is, suppose there is a big population. Okay, now from big population, sometimes what happens? A chunk of the population comes out. Okay, a big population might have a lot of variations. Okay different population a big population of people not i'm not talking about people maybe bacteria or something okay they have some variations each will have different different characteristics okay so from there suppose we take a chunk of population out which has a different characteristics but they're all pure okay a small chunk where they're all pure small chunk of population which has same characteristics and they are a small chunk of it okay so that small chunk of population which has no variation, small population taken out of a larger body, larger population which will have, which are pure and does not have a variation okay that is the founder effect okay suppose we have some bacteria okay all of this bacteria there's a large chunk and some of them can actually some of them can actually temperate tolerate higher temperatures okay a little bit of that Okay. Then you take out all of them, whichever can tolerate higher temperatures, you take them out. Only higher temperature tolerance one. So this is the founder effect. Okay, and that is a factor which is learned from 
genetic drift okay there is a genetic drift there is a variation okay so that is given by genetic drift next when the centromere is situated in the middle of two equal arms of chromosomes the chromosome okay this is so simple in the middle of two equal arms basically it looks like this okay equal this part and this part are equal and it's right in the middle whenever it's middle it will be meta okay meta centric next gamma sorry gamma not gamma cups gamma are present in gamma or gamma or gamma cups are basically present in bryophytes okay such as marcantia and all that is in some kind of liver words okay next during the purification process of recombinant dna technology addition of chilled ethanol okay this is directly copied from previous year i think 2019 okay it's copied from there and the answer is dna chilled ethanol takes the dna right out chilled ethanol okay is used for dna next okay this is for attraction like the attractive forces between water molecules attraction or repulsion in water molecules so let's see cohesion cohesion okay where is my cursor here yeah. yeah cohesion is mutual attraction among the water molecules two water molecules they have mutual attraction that is cohesion okay now adhesion adhesion is not more attraction adhesion is attraction towards polar surfaces okay polar surfaces that is attraction surface tension more attraction in liquid phase we have surface tension in water okay there is more attraction in the liquid phase that causes surface tension and gutation is this water loss in liquid phase this is seen mostly in plants okay when you find transpiration happening in everything you can see gutation let's see a2 b4 a2 b4 1 3 second one next the site of perception of light in plants during photoperiodism whenever you talk about lights whatever it is light is always caught in the plant by a leaf okay it is always the leaf which is happening the photosynthesis everything until and unless it is a special case it will always be the leaf next the plant hormone used to destroy weeds in a field is not not iba not i ia not okay it is 24d 24d is basically 24 dichlorophenoxy acetic acid okay and it is used as a herbicide to take out weeds okay so 24d the answer okay okay somebody is here already hi anvo chalban uh, it is good evening and okay so if you have any question please let me know and i can help you out with it okay let's start which of the following algae produce carrageen carrageen okay carrageen is actually produced with the help of red algae okay it is extracted from red algae 
and mostly used in food industries nowadays it is also used in medicine for medicinal purposes also food industries etc okay so that is red algae next okay this is another central dogma it is another simple very simple question they are asking for the okay a b c d okay dna replicates itself okay so it is replication then dna becomes mrna that is transcription after mrna it is translated okay translation into protein so replication transcription translation protein so it is four which of the following are not secondary metabolites in plants okay so if you see the options only you'll get to know what is the answer rubber and gum are all secondary metabolites so is morphine amino acids are primary metabolites and glucose is actually a raw material also it can be a metabolite it can never be a secondary metabolite it is also a raw material it, okay so now it is also it can be a primary metabolite not a secondary metabolite okay so this is not a secondary metabolite when blast in curcumin this is found in uh, haldi and all okay so this is three next Hmm. In spite of interspecific competition in nature, which mechanism the competing species might have evolved for survival? Okay, this idea we have actually seen in the NEET crash course. We have actually seen this. Okay, so there's this phenomenon where uh, even though there's a, there might there should be com competition between two types of organisms or same kind of organisms because they are. opting for the same prey okay they have the same kind of food but sometimes what happens they evolve and the competition becomes different or they try to adapt into a different kind of food material or something which has been studied by macarthur okay macarthur in warbles the birds where there were different kinds of birds okay same kind of birds but they just adapted to each other and they had they started living in started living in different parts of trees and changed there as in not changed as in adapted to a different to different nutrition okay some were opted for fruit some opted for seeds some opted for different kind of insect etc they just adapted to live with each other okay so that is known as resource partitioning okay where they started living in different different part of the trees one warble was living up, up. one warble was living down one warble was opting for some kind of seeds one warble was opting for different kind of insect okay that kind of adaptation happened in between themselves that is known as resource partitioning okay which of the following is not okay it is not an application of pcr detection of gene mutation of course that is an application okay molecular diagnosis that is also application where pcr we use covid for covid 19 we use pcr remember that the gene amplification that is the purpose where you amplify the dna where you amplify the gene that is also used purification of isolated protein is not done by pcr next okay another one let's see we are here talking about plant tissues okay cells with active cell division tissues having all cells okay cells with active division capacity okay that is meristematic tissue that can be found in even in the 
roots you can find meristematic tissue for the, from where they start growing okay okay uh, tissues having all cells similar in structure and function that is a simple tissue okay they have all simple structures and functions etc okay tissues having different types of cells okay. that is muscular tissues dead cells with highly thickened walls and narrow lumen that is sclerites okay a2 b4 okay option is second one a2 is my cursor okay a2 b4 next a typical angiosperm embryo sac at maturity okay angiosperm angiosperm is where we find double fertilization whenever you talk about angiosperm okay you have to talk about double fertilization so what happens here the nucleus goes through three okay nucleus goes through three mitotic divisions okay so when it's three mitotic divisions it becomes eight nucleus okay so eight nuclear and seven cells eight nucleate seven cell which of the following algae contains mannitol as reserve food material mannitol is actually used like mannitol is reserved mostly by brown algae okay Now, out of this, we have to find what is the brown algae, not Eulotrix. Okay, ectocarpus is a brown algae. No, not Celeria, not Volvox, this ectocarpus. Okay. Genera like Selaginella and Salvinia produce two kinds of spores. Such plants are known as whenever you talk about two kinds of spores, it will always be heterosporous. Okay. Can't be homosporous, homosaurus, and homosaurus. Okay, heterosaurus. No, it is heterosporous. Two kinds. Whenever you're talking about two kinds, male, female, like that, will be heterosporous. Mutations in plant cells can be induced by okay, not zeatin and kinetin. These are all hormones. Infrared rays are not strong enough. They are not strong enough to can which can induce mutation. Gamma rays can. Amensalism, okay, amensalism, very, very easy and this has been repeated also in different question papers. Amensalism is actually where one individual, the one individual will be unaffected, okay, this kind of relation is the one will be unaffected and the other one will be other one will be affected okay there's no gain in this relationship okay it is zero and this is minus okay there's no plus here there's no like nobody gets benefited from this kind of relationship this is this kind of theory is used for uh, antibiotics okay where what is done is the penicillium, okay, penicillium produces penicillin, which again, uh, penicillin, penicillium itself doesn't get affected a lot, like doesn't get affected, nothing happens, neither it is benefited nor harmed, but it harms the, like the microbes, okay, streptococcus, pneumonia and all, they get harmed, okay. So, one is unaffected and one is harmed. So, the uh, answer is okay minus and zero okay what is the role of rna polymerase 3 in the process of transcription in new carriots rna polymerase 3 
will only transcribe the RNA. Of course, thymus RNA is a small part, okay, of the larger subunit of ribosome, and smaller nuclear RNA, okay, which we'll like later, okay. So this is the answer. Okay, select the correct pair. Let's see selecting the correct pair. Spongy parenchyma, okay, loose parenchyma cells rupturing the epidermis and forming lens shaped opening in the bark. No, this is not correct because it is in chlorophyll cells and etc., not in the bark. Large subsidiary cells, large colorless empty cells in epidermis of grass leaves. Not really, actually, because it is mostly in stomata and all that you can find it. Dicot leaves, vascular one is mostly found in monocot leaves, also dicot leaves, also. So this is not okay. Interfascicular cambium cells of medullary rays that form part of cambial ring. Okay, so the answer is four. Okay, this is actually a bit of a tricky question which I found because like it's simple. The answer is inside the question only, but you have to read it properly. Okay, so plasmid PBR322 has PST1 restriction enzyme with a gene ampicillin R that confers ampicillin resistance. Okay, so the plasmid has ampicillin has restriction site, the gene MPR has provides ampicillin resistance. If this enzyme is used for inserting a gene for beta galactosidase production and the recombinant plasmid is inserted in an E. coli strain, okay, whenever you put beta, beta gal another thing it has been put, what will happen? This AMPR, this ampicillin resistance will become inactivated. Okay. And it will not be able to confer ampicillin resistance to the whole cells because it has become inactivated restriction enzyme beta galactosidase, beta galactosidase and everything is there so the ampr becomes inactivated and it will not be confirmed conferred into the host cell next dna fingerprinting involves identifying the differences in some specific regions of dna whenever you talk about dna fingerprinting it will always be repetitive DNA. This is directly from NCRT book. DNA fingerprinting. Always uses repetitive DNA. Okay. So, let's see. Next. The exponential growth equation, okay, exponential growth equation, what does the E represent? Let's see. Now, in this, NT is population at time T or population density at time T. N0 is population density at time zero e is the natural logarithm okay base so base of natural logarithms which of the following statement is incorrect okay we have to find the incorrect statement Cyclic photophosphorylation involves both PS1 and PS2. First one only. It is the non cyclic photophosphorylation which involves PS1 and PS2. Cyclic photophosphorylation only involves PS1. So the answer is 1. Okay, we are actually going a bit slow. We'll start gaining some kind of momentum and we'll start. Okay, let's see. Which of the following statement is correct? Correct. We have to find the correct statement. Some organisms can fix atmospheric nitrogen in special cells called sheet cells. Okay. Fusion of two cells is called karyogamy. No. 
diffusion of protoplasms between two motile or non motile gametes is called plasmogametes. Next. Okay, we are not even half. Wait, let's see. try to get some momentum. Okay, nitrococcus. Okay, nitrococcus, very easy conversion of ammonia to nitrate. Rhizobium. Denitrification. Mm. Okay. See, isobium is conversion of atmospheric nitrogen to ammonia. Thiobacillus. That's denitrification. Nitrobacter. Conversion of nitrate to nitrate. Okay, second option. Which of the statement is incorrect? Another one. Oxidation reduction reactions produce a uh, proton gradient in respiration. During an aerob aerobic respiration, role of oxygen is, still, is limited to terminal stage. In electron transport chain, one molecule of NADH plus and H plus gives rise to, no, this gives rise to three ATP molecules, okay? One molecule gives rise to three and one FADH2 gives rise to two ATP molecules. So it is interchanged. This is the answer. In some members, which of the following pairs of families, pollen grains retain their viability for months? Okay. See, Rosa say they do. Leguminous say they also do. Roa say they don't do. Okay, the answer is one. Identify the correct statement. Split gene arrangement is a characteristic. Split gene arrangement is not fine in prokaryotes. In capping, methyl guanosine triphosphate is added to the three and no. Not in hRNA, not three, three prime end. RNA polymerase binds with rho factor to terminate. Yes, rho factor is used to terminate the process of transcription. When it is over, the rho factor comes and joins, okay, in the complex and ends the transcription. Okay, this is a bit tricky. This the plural formula. And you have to find it. Okay. Let me try to solve it. This is this. Let me see. Okay, this corresponds to Solonacy. Okay. And persecuci. Okay. A3, A3, B4, C2, D1. Okay. Biomolecules and their this thing, whatever is contained in the biomolecules. Proteins is made up of peptide bonds. Very simple. Okay, nucleic acid, phosphodiester bonds, polysaccharide, glycosidic bonds, unsaturated fatty acids. Okay, so A4, okay, B1, oh, second one. Okay, pardon the quality, just directly copied from a question paper. Whenever you talk about G1 S G2 M G1 S G2 M. Okay. S phase is for synthesis phase of the DNA. It will always be DNA replication. G2. Okay, where is G2? Here. G2 is your interval between mitosis and initiation of this G1. Okay, G2 is C2 is where protein is synthesized. Present stage is inactive phase, that is 
g0 okay g1 interval phase between mitosis and initiation of dna peak mitosis and synthesis phase okay the answer is s4 b1 okay next nowadays it is possible to detect the mutated gene causing cancer by allowing radioactive probe to hybridize its complementary dna in a clone of cells with followed by detection using autoradiography okay autoradiography this is not a complicated all you have to do is read it okay detect the mutated gene causing cancer by allowing radioactive probe to hybridize its complementary dna in clone of cells the, the thing is the mutated gene the gene thing cannot come on the photographic film and there is no probe also which works as a complementary okay so the thing is as i said it does not appear on photographic scans and all it doesn't appear it does not appear photography then and there are no probes also okay no probes are there which is complementary that's why it doesn't come so the answer is mutated gene does not appear on photographic film has no complementary probe. okay next erythropoietin hormone which stimulates rbc formation is produced by the juxtamerular juxtaglomerular cells of the kidney erythropoietin is always happening in juxtaglomerular cells of kidney next with the following characteristics which of the following characteristics is incorrect with respect to cockroach okay let's see 10th abdominal segment in both sexes appears pair of annals or c okay there is an anal sexy like this okay the ring of gastric cava is present in the junction of midgut and hindgut no i don't think it is at the junction of midgut and hindgut hypopharynx lies within cavity and closed at the mouth parts okay the female seventh and eighth together form a genital pouch okay. answer is succus entericus okay very very easy directly succus entericus is a kind of intestinal juice this direct question small ones this is so easy to actually score marks here which stage of meiotic prophase shows terminalization of plasmata as it whenever the terminalization whenever we talk about terminalization terminalization of plasmata it will always be diakinesis okay terminalization of chiasmata will be diakinesis partial pressures of oxygen and partial carbon dioxide at alveoli of site of diffusion site of diffusion okay so partial pressure of oxygen will be 104 and partial pr pressure of carbon dioxide will be 40 okay 104 and 40 okay so scientific names for example the water okay okay and cyclostomata is hookworm Pink tada is pearl oyster. I'll just do this and try to match it. C four, C four, C three, D. Okay. This two, Lamellus is living fossil. Next.
during the process of gene amplification using PCR, so many PCR based questions. If very high temperature is not maintained in the beginning, then which of the following steps of PCR will be affected? Whenever there is no high temperature, denaturation needs high temperature to break the bonds in the DNA, okay, to separate the strands, okay. So, when denaturation happening, you need 94 degrees Celsius an hour above, okay. So, when it's not happening, then the denaturation will get affected. So simple. Okay. Byproducts. Aspergillus niger, this is also repeated. This was also there. Acetobacter acetes, acetic acid, clostridium botulinum oxide, butric acid, lactobacillus lactic acid, aspergillus niger, lactic acid. Okay. A3B1. Second one. Which of the following statements strongly represents the nature of smooth muscles? We are talking about smooth muscles. These muscles are present at wall of blood vessels. The muscles have no striations because they are smooth. They are involuntary muscles. Communication among the muscles is formed by intercalated trees. No. Communication among cells is performed not by intercalated. This is a feature of cardiac muscles. Okay. So, this is wrong. Next, chronic autoimmune, dis autoimmune disorder affecting neuromuscular junction leading to fatigue, weakening of paralysis, weakening and paralysis of skeletal muscle. Gout is, it happens in the joints, okay. There is uric acid deposition, uric acid deposition in joints that is gout. Arthritis is autoimmune rheumatoid arthritis is autoimmune but it affects the joints again muscular dystrophy is genetic condition so it is misthenia gravis persons with ab blood group are called universal recipients because they don't have antibodies okay whenever there's foreign they don't have antibodies so that's why they can take any kind of blood group okay the fruit fly has eight chromosomes two and each eight chromosomes chromosomes are two and okay in each cell during interphase of mitosis if the number of chromosomes at g1 phase g1 phase is eight okay when it's two n is eight after chromosomes also after it could be the number of chromosomes after S phase it will always be 2 and only, no? The answer is 8. Receptors for sperm binding in ma mammals is present in zona pellucida. Very direct question. Receptors for sperm binding is present in zona pellucida. Which of the following family, following belongs to the family? Mucidae. Okay. Firefly is Lampyridae. Okay. okay. Might be my spelling might be a bit mistaken. Okay. So grasshopper is acrid. Cockroach can be of a lot of families, mostly Labridae, Blattidae, etc. Okay, Mucidae is housefly. Identify the correct, incorrect pair. Drugs, ricin. No, ricin is a type of leptin. Okay, and it's poisonous. It's not a drug. It's poisonous in nature. It's poison. Answer is alkaloid. Codeine is an alkaloid. Toxin is abrin. Lectin is contablin A. Okay. Venereal diseases, these are STDs which can spread through sterile needles. No, it can spread through needles but affected needles, not sterile needles. Okay. Transfusion of blood from infected person, yes. Infected mother to fetus, possibly. Kissing, no. Inheritance, no. Okay. So, B and C only. The organelles that are included in endomembrane system. So, what is endomembrane system? Endomembrane system is that they are like 
suspended in the cytoplasma okay of the eukaryotic cell those are the endomembrane system inside the cytoplasm plasma they are suspended there so not mitochondria mitochondria is not there okay mitochondria they have their own system everything so not mitochondria whatever that does not have mitochondria that will be endoplasmic reticulum golgi complex lysosomes and vacuoles so the answer is three next for the effective treatment of disease early diagnosis and understanding its path pathophysiology is important which of the following molecular diagnostic techniques is very useful for early detection okay so this is a trick question the answer is elisa okay it can also be southern blot because southern blot although not used a lot right now but it is actually used for early detection of problems like diseases okay so it can be three or four the most probable one is elisa because it is still used okay so it can be three or four with regard to insulin choose the correct options c peptide is not okay correct option a the insulin produced by our dna technology does not have c peptide no it does not have okay pro insulin has c peptide and peptide a b of insulin are interconnected by disulfide which is so a c and b four one the specific recognition sequence identified by endonuclease to make cuts at specific position specific positions will always be palindromic nucleotide sequences okazaki sequences are those lagging strand sequences no degenerate primer sequence no polyuria sequence no it is palindromic sequence okay the only which is the only enzyme okay, why i don't know why they have put in the uh, this thing closed captions okay which is the only enzyme that has a uh, capability to initiate catalyze initiation elongation termination process of the transcription in prokaryotes is dna dependent rna polymerase always remember it is rna polymerase not dna polymerase okay whenever you talk about transcription it will be rna polymerase but because it is giving rise to a rna so it will always be rna polymerase okay which of the following organisms bears Hollow pneumatic long bones. Long bones is neopron. Read the following statements and choose the correct options from below. Okay, metagenesis is observed in helminths. I don't think so. Metagenesis not observed in helminths. Metagenesis is mostly found in arthropods and all, not helminths. Okay, echinoderms are triploblastic, triploblastic and coelomate. Okay, yes. round worms have organ system of body organization yes they have that is from where the organization starts comb plates are present in tenophores that help no comb plates are not there for digestion no okay water vascular system is characteristic of echinoderms so yes b c and e okay so this is for okay so walls walls is i think yes entry of sperm through cervix is blocked iud's iud's do this phagocytosis of sperms within the uterus vasectomy is done on males where they remove the vas deferens and tubectomy is seen in females for fallopian tube so one yeah sphincter of odi is present in okay whenever you talk about sphincter of odi there should be the pancreatic duct okay it's between pancreatic duct and duodenum if adenine makes 30% of dna okay this is so many times this has been repeated okay that is chargaff's rule okay what does it state 
adenine and guanine guanine will be cytosin equal to cytosine fam and so when it's come to 100% so since it's a goes to t so these will be equal okay a and t will always be equal so this is 30% if a is 30% then t will also be 30% okay 30% 30% is 60% now 100 minus 60 is 40 we know what we know c will be cytosine will be equal to guanine okay so c plus g is 40 and c is equal to g so 20 e is equal to g is equal to 20 so t30 g20 c20 char gaps rule always remember okay so this is about characteristics in non vertebrates or in vertebrates sorry metamerism okay found in mollusks this annelida canal system where the body takes the water out and then it takes the water in again so that is complates in seen is seen in tenophora and nidoblasts in Colenterata. So A3 and B4, A3, B4, C2. Okay. Next. Which of the enzyme is responsible for conversion of inactive fibrinogens to fibrins? Thrombin. Direct question that is thrombin. Converts inactive fibrogens to fibrins. Which of the following is not an objective of bifortification of crops? Bifortification of crops, when generally said that the crops are actually given a better, like the it is nutrition based fortification. Okay, the nutrition based it is given a better nutrition. It gives better nutrition to animals or whatever. Okay, so nutritionally it is enhanced, improved micronutrient and mineral content. Yes. That is an objective. Improve protein content. Yes. Improve resistance to diseases. No, that is not. It is basically just for nutrition. The answer is three. Improve vitamin content. Dobson units are used to measure ozone. Which of the following is an example of hormone releasing IUD? Hormone releasing IUD is LNG30. Energy 20 because it releases levono ester gel. Okay, yeah. this kind of hormones are released by LNG 20. The centriole undergoes duplication during centriole undergoes duplication during S phase. Okay, synthesis phase they undergo duplication. Okay, next. Which of the following RNAs is not required for synthesis of protein? Synthesis of protein, the main RNAs are mRNA, tRNA, rRNA. Okay. So, this is what is required in translation. There is an siRNA that is smaller interference RNA or silence RNA that is not required for the synthesis of protein. That is usually for the cutting out the extra part. Okay. For the, what is it? For the transformation of the product and all. This is required. So, SIRNA is the answer. Select the favorable conditions required for the low formation of oxyhemoglobin at alveoli. This same kind of question was there just a bit back. So, they have concentrated on this topic a lot. Okay. So, this is high. Okay. Go to. Low and it should be less hydrogen ions, and the temperature should also be 
low. Okay, this is the favorable condition. See, no doubt. High, low, less, lower. Okay, Allen's rule. Allen's rule is polar seal where they said the limbs should be short. Okay, because it's so cold, the limbs should be short. Physiological adaptation is kangaroo rat where they don't take because they have so much dirt and water they don't they, their urine is very concentrated or they don't pass out urine at all okay they take oil vesicles and everything is there that is the physiological adaptation in kangaroo rat and deserts okay behavioral adaptation is desert, desert. okay and biochemical adaptation is marine fish at depth Okay, to maintain their Allen's rule A4 and B2. Okay. Oh, this is already solved. Okay, but we'll solve it for you. Adaptive radiation is always Darwin's finches, where they were different kind of a, they spread it out, finches went out and they had adaptation in their beaks. Some had flat beaks, some had sharp beaks for different kind of food. So that is adaptive radiation. Convergent evolution, okay, that is wings of butterfly and bird, okay. Although they are both wings, but they have different they have different structure etc okay for different kind of purposes so convergent divergent is again bones of pollens in man and whale okay different functions but same kind evolution of anthropogenic action is selection of resistant varieties due to excessive use of herbicides and pesticides c a4 Which of these is an important component of initiation of parturition in human? Parturition is basically the giving birth. Okay, whatever is required in giving birth, that point when a human woman is giving birth. Okay, that is known as parturition. Okay. So during that time, you don't need prolactin. Prolactin is not required. Prolactin is basically for the mammary glands and the secretion of milk. Okay, that is not required during just giving birth. You don't require that. So this release of prolactin. Because increase of estrogen progesterone ratio that is required. Prostaglandins is required. Oxytocin is required. But prolactin is not required. Which of the following statements about histone is wrong? Histones carry positive charge, okay, yes. Histones are organized to form eight molecules, yes. pH of histones is slightly acidic, no, it's alkaline. We all know histones are alkaline in nature, okay. Next, during the muscular contraction, which of the following occurs? H zone disappears, yes, it does disappear. A band widens, no, it Mostly it remains in the same size or it can become short, but it never widens. That is what is happening in contraction, right? Because muscular contraction, the A mostly goes, becomes small or it remains in the same position, but it never increases. So that is not. Okay, I band reduces its width, myosin hydrolyzes ATP, releases ADP and inorganic phosphates. Z lines attached to actins pulled inwards. Yes. So A, C, D, E. Second A, C, D, E. Okay. So this is another one. Match the list one with list two. I've not seen the chat. Okay. Let's see. Okay. Next question. Okay. Scalpula, cranium, but sternum, vertebral column. These are the bones. Whatever we have, we have to match that. 
what is calcula let's find out what is calcula it is a triangular flat bone cranium okay, cranium is there in the head it is fibrous joints sternum is flat bone the vertebral column is cartilaginous joints okay scalpula a4 one a person goes to high altitude and experiences altitude sickness with symptoms like breathing difficulty heart palpitations due to low atmospheric the reason is due to low atmospheric pressure at high altitude the body does not get sufficient oxygen okay think it's a and r are of course both true let's read it again person goes to high altitude and experiences altitude sickness with symptoms like breathing difficulty and heart palpitations okay. both are correct and the it is the correct explanation adenosine demyelinase deficiency results into dysfunction of immune system this is corrected by gene therapy which of the following is not a step in multiple ovulation embryo transfer moet fertilized eggs are transferred to surrogate at 8 to 32 yes cow is administered hormone having lh like activity for super ovulation no cow yields 6 to 8 eggs at a time cow is fertilized by for artificial okay is two okay diseases and their microorganisms which causes it filariasis scheleria bankrupti amebosis and tamiba pneumonia hemophilus influenzae ringworm trichophyton a3 okay which of the following are statements with reference to lipids okay let's see lipids hmm. lipids having one single bond oh, no, no, no that is not that lecithin is a phospholipid yes trihydroxy propane is glycerol aromatic acid is 20 carbons in, including carboxyl so b and c following are the statements about prostomium of okay the body of the earthworm it serves covering for mouth yes okay it helps to open cracks into soil which it can crawl yes it has it is one of the sensory structures the first body segment no that's not true so a b c which of the following secretes hormone relaxing of okay, that is corpus luteum that is the one which gives out relaxin the codon aug codes for methionine and phenylalanine no it is wrong Methionine, no, not phenylalanine. AUG is also a start codon. Okay, A A A and A B B are both codons for amino acid lysine. This is true. The statement. Okay, statement one is incorrect, but statement two. Okay. Identify the types of cell junctions that. help to stop the leakage of substances across tissue facilitation of communication with neighboring cells via rapid transfer of ions and molecules okay okay not adhering junctions adhering junctions are not there gap junctions no be tight junctions and gap junctions okay so thank you everyone for coming to the class today we solved the 2021 question paper 
and i hope it was a bit although we have a little less time and we had to solve around 100 questions so we did a bit did it a bit fast okay and uh, if you have any doubts you can let us know okay you can like share and subscribe to our video and i'll see you guys in the next class bye bye